Hi, I'm David the Bruce, and this is Jungle Queens, and today we're taking a look at a very interesting serial. Now, the Jungle Queens, sometimes they were movies, but more times than not, they were serial. So, you know, you'd have to see them over a number of weeks. Every time you went to the theater, you'd see 20 minutes, and it ended with a cliffhanger. So you would have to come back the following week to see the rest. Pretty clever, huh? And Jungle Queen movies were all the rage at the time. And uh, it was, uh, you know, they happened because there was emerging sort of kind of out of the sexist, racist culture, this whole idea of independent women, that women aren't necessarily defined by being a, a wife and a mother at home doing house cleaning and oh, making meals and all that. that that there was uh, uh, something more than that in life for women. And so Jungle Queens were the um, uh, sort of addressing that and looking at it, but at a safe distance over in Africa. <laughs> but anyway, what you're going to see here, some critics have called the best, the very best of the Jungle Queen serials. This is it. And uh, I got to tell you that it is like over four hours long. If you take all the cereals and put them together, you come out with a, a over four hours of, of film. So what I've done is I've taken it and I've uh, put them together and then divided it into uh, three parts. And in each part, there's a number of, of episodes. So I, don't, I didn't want to do just the episodes because, boy, that would take for a long time, right? And this was one of the longest-running serials. So, uh, and I didn't want to string them all together. Who's going to sit there for over four hours watching this thing? So I did it in three segments. So uh, you're going to see the same intro with me introing in each of the three. And you are in for a very fun ride. Pay attention to the side because over on the side I have put factoids about um, Kay Aldrich, the amazing actress uh, who does this, a little bit about her, some of the a photo gallery, also about uh, Jungle Queens, the comic book craze at the time. Oh, there's just so many things you need to know and I put that over on the side so that you can kind of follow along. I hope it's not too distracting. but. There it is. You're going to have, you're going to know more than you ever thought you needed to know by the time these three have run their course. Ah, oh, man, we've got a lot to do. Okay, so there you go. I'm David the Bruce. Enjoy.
see if you can find the inscription. Goddess, none may leave or enter. In here. They should have been back long ago. Yes, that's right. I wonder what's keeping them. Well, let's bust into the place and find them. We could never force our way in against that horde of warriors armed with bombs. I'm going to scout around that side entrance and see what the setup is. Very well. If you find a way to get in, let us know. You betcha. Now go on, beat it back to camp, will you? Go on, beat it. Beat it. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, that's the way you feel about it. But stop your chatter, will you? Not a chance, Jitters. Hey, come down here a minute. Hey, come here. Maybe you can do it. Now look, you see those warriors? You think you can sneak behind him and find Larry and Iopa? I hope you're right. Maybe they can figure out a way to send a note back.
Jenners. Jenners. Paper and pencil. It's to send them a message telling them where we are. We'll tell them to attack the guards at the side entrance so we can escape. All right, Jimmers. We'll take this back to Red. Useless. The inscription is completely destroyed. <coughs> Allah, a message from the infidels asking help. We're hiding near the side entrance. Attack there, Larry. Now I can prove my powers and win the confidence of the Toreg chief. You have not yet found the intruders? Never has the sun goddess failed. I will prove it to you now. Summon your warriors. O oh, light of the sun, reveal to me now your humble servant, the hiding place of our enemies. I see a small chamber, an alcove, close by the side entrance. You know of such a place? Yes. It is used for the storage of food. The white infidels are there. Seize them! It shall be done, illustrious one.
Ioka. We've got to get back in there. Well, we can't get back in that way, Doc. That guard will sound the alarm. They'll be swarming out there like a bunch of bees. Wait a minute, Red. We'll climb to the top of the cliff. We might be able to get in that way. White infidels, you have profaned the sacred temple of the Torahs. You have attempted to steal the golden tablets from their rightful owners. To appease the wrath of our people, you must die in the fiery pit. Father, I'm Nyoka. Don't you recognize me? Dad, I'm your daughter. That could not be. You are a foreigner, and I, the Torah chief. No, no, you're Henry Gordon. Look, the initials H.G. on your ring. That's strange. I do not understand it. Enough of this. The infidel is trying to avoid the fate ordained for her. Prepare the fire. Sun goddess, let your rays burn the rope and plunge your sacrifice into the fire.
goddess, let your rays burn the rope and plunge your sacrifice into the fire. sure of it, Nyoka? There isn't the slightest doubt. Did he recognize you? No, not even when I called him father. He acted so strangely as though robbed of his memory. I must talk to him, make him remember me. All right, now's the time to try it with the warriors out after us. Now, that makes sense. I can sneak back to the camp and tell the others to pack. It's risky, Red. Ah, there's nothing to it. We'll meet you where we left the horses in the station wagon. Right? at the appointed place with our horses? Yes, gracious mother. Quickly, then. See the Torag chief and take him to my temple. But why? Because he is Henry Gordon, scientist who disappeared years ago. Locked somewhere in his mind is a secret to the golden tablets and the treasure. Come with me. I don't understand. Come on, I say. Stop. Larry, they're taking father away. We've got to stop them. Yes, but could you see where Valtura was taking father? 
Probably taking him to her temple. Let's meet the others and go after him. The expedition will surely follow us and attempt to rescue this garden. We'll be safely in the temple by the time they attack us. Yeah, what you say is true. But they have left stores of food and ammunition near Nayuka's cave. Why don't we destroy these things and leave them helpless? Excellent, Cassie. Do it at once. You have heard the order. Batan, take Hassan and carry out my plan. Come, Hassan. We have work to do. So we'll go to Nyoka's cave first and get organized. Good. Hurry and pack the rest of these things, men. We'll ride ahead cross country and get the guns and ammunition ready when you arrive. Fine. Just in time to save the ammunition and most of the supplies. Untie those men. Take care of this man, Abu. Otura well, will expect an attack. We'd better get started before she has time to organize. It'll not be easy. Voltura has many guards, not to mention Kassip and his Arabs. We'll have to chance that. Nayok and I will sneak in from the rear of the temple. We'll try and save Gordon while the rest of you attack from the front. It's a good plan. Come on, Larry. Get your horses and plenty of ammunition. May need this to get down those cliffs. Oh, guard him. to attack your temple. The infidels! Magrib, post the guards. They open the doctor plan to enter from the rear. Ride to Kassib's camp and have him bring his men here. But what of the doctor and Ioka? If they reach the cell, they'll regret it. Go! There's the temple's back entrance. We'd better get this rope set. If we have to leave here in a hurry, we'd want to climb those rocks again. That's right.
Have you decided to tell me where the tablets of Hippocrates are hidden? You represent evil. The tablets must never fall into your hands. I have many ways of making you speak. Satan, for instance. <laughs> Not yet, Satan. But stay here and guard this obstinate fool.
if we stay here. To get your father? No. We'll have to meet him for camp quick. What happened? Where's Larry? Larry got out of the temple all right. He's probably going back to the camp. Good. Let's get out of here. Too late, Cassidy. Is Valtor in the temple? Yes. Gracious one, had your messenger reached me sooner, none of the infidels would now be alive. Satan was more prompt than you. He killed Nyoka when she attempted to rescue her father. Alo is kind. With Nyoka dead and Gordon in our power, those white men will cause us no more trouble. What you say is true. But unless Gordon reveals to us the meaning of the ruined inscription, we are powerless to act. We'll force him to confess. Come with me.
How much longer would you keep me from my people? Only you can answer that question. If you continue to show the stubbornness of the mule, you'll never see them again. Death is not such a terrible thing. Sometimes it is beautiful. Other times it is hideous. Cassip is an expert in the art of torture. I'm sure he'd be delighted to show you. With the greatest of pleasure, I can assure you. Every moment lost brings you closer to death. I must think. you wish to know. The inscription contained instructions for finding the golden tablets of Hippocrates. Where are they? Buried with other valuable treasures beneath a huge rock in uh, Devil's Gorge. Men have been known to enter Devil's Gorge, but none ever came back. Those are words of wisdom, gracious one. By following the instructions I will give you, all danger will be avoided. I have a much better plan than that. You will go with us and thus doubly ensure our safety. A simple solution, is it not? Yes. Not only simple, but wise. Then you will lead us. Unlock the door. Didn't you get him? No. The other's inside? Yes, but Come on in. I'll tell you all about it. Larry, where's Dad? I couldn't get to him, Nyoka. But, Larry, I hope Don't that... worry. He's safe for the time being. How can you be sure of that? I heard him agree to take Volturra to where the tablets of Hippocrates are hidden. Do you know where they are? Yes. A place called the Devil's Gorge. If we get there in time, we can save Gordon, and possibly get the tablets, too. I know a way of getting into that gorge that cuts off miles, but it's hard going. We'll try it. 
Of all I've ever heard of the Devil's Gorge, you sign your death warrant the minute you enter it. Possibly, but we'll have to risk that. Come on, Larry. signal to cut it loose. chance.
Robert's always stationed in the gorge, so we'd better go on foot from here. Right. Wait for my signal to cut it loose. chance. stop the people following him. Larry, they've captured Father. We've got to help him. Let's get to our horses. Situation's well in hand. Yes, but let's get out of here before those Torags come too. We 
would have laid too long. It was useless to try to follow Voltura. Oh, it's of a horrid experience. At least you're fortunate to be alive. Tell Abu to have horses ready with lariats. Then meet me outside. Okay, Doc. We must work out an immediate plan to rescue your father, the chief. Meanwhile, it's consoling to know he'll not hand over Hippocrates' treasure to Valtura if he can avoid it. Oh, naturally not. What's up, Skipper? Wild the ropes. Yeah, we may need them to get into Volturra's temple to save Gordon. She'll torture him for double-crossing her. Oh, that's swell, but won't we need to take Nyoka with us? Yeah, there might be shooting. The sides will be gone before she notices. Come on, Red. And I've decided to leave immediately. But, uh, surely, Signorina, you won't attempt to save your father from Volturra single-handed. I intend to find out where he is and then ask you to help me to rescue him. Oh, by all means. You agreed to lead our expedition, provided that we help find your father. The contract stands. Thanks. They go to Voltura's temple to rescue White Chief, your father. Voltura may have expected us to storm her temple. And she may have taken him to Cassib's village. But, Sahiba, you... I'm going to see. You stay here with the others. Come on, Fang. Much too patient, Cassib. Threats don't frighten him. He refuses to answer. He must. Prepare the irons. Sahiba, the shock of the iron may kill him before we learn his secret. Now we must find the tablets without his help. My patience is exhausted. Either he tells us where they are, or he dies. As long as you don't move, Fang won't hurt you. Guard her, Fang, until I return. you fool. Your time is nearly up. The irons.
Nayok is in this camp disguised as one of our women. Seize the woman and bring her here. Go back, Fang. Go back. Fang, get Abu, understand? Abu. Go on. Something's wrong. Fang returned from the village of Kassim. Nyoka must be in trouble. Get your Bedouins ready to ride. The rest of you arm yourselves. We'll raid Kassim's camp. will be very useful to us. Take her inside. Hurry, Cassid. No! Tell them, Father, they'll kill you. Let them. Now we will see if you prefer leading us to the tablets of Hippocrates or suffering a slow death. <laughs>
Those who will burn, conquer. Hurt? I can't tell till we get him back to Nyoka's cave. Pick him up gently. Red, get the horses. The men and I'll pursue the infidels and give them battle. No, Cassid. They're growing bolder. Next, they may try to attack the temple. You speak the truth. As soon as my men return, we'll guard the temple's every approach. Complicated case. The old fracture left the bone fragment pressing on the brain. That causes loss of memory. Now, this injury has increased the pressure until he is practically paralyzed. Please, don't smoke. Oh, of course not. Eh? Excuse me. Can you do anything for him? Yes. I'll operate as soon as he recovers from the shock. I can remove the bone fragment. That should restore his memory up to the time of his first injury. Do you suppose he'll be able to remember everything that happened during the time he was with the Toregs? No, I'm afraid that part of his life will be a complete blank. But then he won't remember where the tablets are. No, but I could give him an injection of adrenaline before I operate. That might revive him enough to let him talk. The shock might prove fatal. Don't even consider it. Oh, goodness, no. Is there anything we can do? I'll fix up an operating room in the rear alcove. You and Ioka can help. The rest of you had better wait outside.
Tora must not get the golden tablets. You must save them from her. Yes. Where are they? In the tomb of the moon god. Terrific shock of some kind. He's been drugged. But how? Who could? Get the operating table ready. Naoka, you stay here with him while I talk to the others. Red! Yeah! Abu, did anybody come out of the cave just now? No, I don't think so. How about you, Red? Did you see anyone? No. <laughs> I say, sir, anything wrong? Someone sneaked in the camp and drugged Gordon. Really? Pretty bad shape. I'll have to operate at once. There's something I can do. Did you see anyone come out of the cave just now? No, I didn't. Abu, take a group of your men and throw a guard around the camp. Let no one in or out. Red, you watch the inside. Right. Spencer, you patrol the outside. Right out. Torini, you watch the outside of the cave, please. Special brand. Could you pick that up here? There's something awful funny about this. You and I are going to find out what, too. Hey, Terini, come here. matter of a cigarette. I uh, found it here where Gordon was drugged. How come? Why, uh... I must have dropped it when we were all here together. No, you didn't. You weren't smoking then. Doc asked us not to. Then how do you know it's mine? Let's see it.
Who is that? Perini. What's the matter with him? I'll tell you what's the matter with him. Grayson, I'll take those guns. Now over to the car. You know what to do in case the infidels come this way. They shall not pass. Now the temple's protected at every point. Come. What are you going to do with us? I'm taking you to Voltura's temple. She'd be very happy to have you as guests. But she'll be even happier over the information I'm bringing. Come on, get in back. You must be very proud of your treachery. Rather, let us say I'm very pleased at the thought of my share of the treasure. Come on, get in. of the infidels. Light the fuse. 